टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न स्टेर के टाइम आर स्विच वायरिंग वर्किंग एंड एप्लीकेशन इन दिस वीडियो वी हैव वन स्टेर के टाइम आर स्विच बाय दिस स्टेर के टाइम आर स्विच वी कैन कंट्रोल वन लोड फ्रॉम मल्टीपल प्लेसेस इन स्टेर के कंट्रोल वायरिंग वी कंट्रोल वन लोड फ्रॉम टू डिफरेंट प्लेसेस यू कैन सी हेयर बाय दिस कंट्रोल वायरिंग वी कैन स्टार्ट लोड फ्रॉम वन स्विच एंड कैन स्टॉप फ्रॉम अदर स्विच बट इन दिस कंट्रोल वायरिंग यू हैव टू स्टार्ट एंड स्टॉप योर लोड मेनुअली बट इफ यू यूज दिस स्ट्रेट लाइट टाइमर स्विच देन यू कैन कंट्रोल योर लोड फ्रॉम मल्टीपल प्लेसेस ऑल्सो यू जस्ट नीड टू स्टार्ट योर लोड बाई प्रेसिंग पुश बटन आर स्विच ओके यू जस्ट नीड टू प्रेस वन टाइम एंड योर लोड विल स्टॉप ऑटोमेटिकली अकॉर्डिंग टू दिस टाइम यू कैन सी हियर वेन टाइमर टाइमिंग विल कंप्लीट सो योर लोड विल स्टॉप ऑटोमेटिकली यू कैन कंट्रोल योर लोड फ्रॉम मल्टीपल प्लेसेस वन प्लेस टू प्लेस आर टेन प्लेस एज यू रिक्वायर्ड ओके यू जस्ट नीड टू स्टार्ट योर लोड एंड योर लोड विल स्टॉप ऑटोमेटिकली अकॉर्डिंग टू टाइमर टाइम ओके एंड ऑल्सो एप्लीकेशन of this staircase timer switch so you can connect this staircase timer switch from multiple places like corridor stairways halls and bathroom for controlling light and fan hope you clear the concept of this staircase timer switch so let's start video and first learn about this staircase timer switch so you can see here this is staircase timer switch which is made by cnc electric and model number you can see here on your screen on this staircase timer switch first you can see here on auto and off function so first learn about this function if you control any load with this staircase timer switch and if you want to start your load permanently so you just need to on this button if you on this button your load on permanently if you want to stop your load permanently so just press off button and if you want to control your load oh, that means when you press push button or switch single time so your load will run and it will run according to timer timing okay when timer timing will complete so your load will stop automatically okay so if you want to control your load according to timer time so you can select auto also we have two indicator one is green indicator and second is red indicator green indicator is for input power supply when you connect input power supply in this timer so your green indicator will blink and if load run with this staircase timer so red indicator will blink so red indicator for load on and green indicator for input power supply okay. now let's learn a connection so connection is very simple only four terminal l and 3 and 4 okay so before learn a connection first see current carrying capacity so you can connect a 16 ampere load directly with this timer switch and if you have more than 16 ampere so you need to connect to one contactor okay now learn about connection so connection is very simple you can see here switch symbol so you can connect a doorbell switch also push button in this switch symbol okay now let's learn about connection so connection is very simple first connect a phase wire or line wire in l terminal and connect a neutral in n terminal okay you can see here line wire connect in l terminal and neutral connect in n terminal okay so input power supply connect first now learn the control wiring so first we connect a phase wire to load from four number point of timer you can see here phase wire connect from four number point to load okay now let's learn about neutral control wiring okay so neutral connect in n terminal so first connect a neutral directly to switch or push button input terminal when push button or switch press so output goes in three number terminal you can see here so when switch or push button will press so neutral comes in three number point so by push button or switch we control neutral wire okay and neutral connects load directly okay in this staircase timer switch we have one knob for timing setting you can see here you can set time from 0.5 minute to 20 minute that means from 30 second to 20 minute so you can set timing manually how much time do you want to run your load so you can set timing manually okay now let's learn about control wiring connection so if you want to control this staircase timer switch from multiple places so if you connect a push button so connect the first ano element in this push button and if you control this timer switch in home so first connect a doorbell switch you can see here and if you want to control your load from three different places so connect a three switch now let's learn a connection so connect all push button parallel connection you can see here connect all push button parallel okay you can see here also connect ano element 
this two wire goes in your staircase timer switch now let's see connection with this doorbell switch so also we connect a doorbell switch parallel connection you can see here we connect a yellow wire in all switch bottom position you can see here and red wire from all switches top position so we just made simple parallel connection and this two wire connects in a staircase timer okay so this is very simple parallel connection now let's learn a complete connection so first connect a phase wire from mcb to l terminal so phase wire connect here also connect a neutral wire so we connect a neutral wire from mcb and connect n terminal okay so input power supply is now done now learn a control wiring with doorbell switch or push button okay so we connect a two wire in this doorbell switch so bottom terminal wire connects in n terminal so neutral connects in this doorbell switch okay so neutral first connect in this doorbell switch when doorbell switch press so neutral comes here and connect in three terminal okay so three number terminal neutral comes when push button or switch press okay now load connection is very simple first we connect a load phase wire in four number terminal and connect a neutral directly to load okay so we connect a phase wire from timer switch four number point and neutral connects directly okay now learn the working of this staircase timer switch we just turn on mcb okay now green indicator is blinking if you want to turn on your light permanently so just on this switch and if you stop your light permanently so stop or off this switch okay for auto operation first select auto and set timing we set 30 second you can set any desired time which you required okay now when we press push button or doorbell switch so your load will start okay it will run for 30 second which time you set in this timer after timing complete your load will stop automatically you can see here when timing complete so your load will stop automatically you can control your load from multiple places one place two place or ten place which you want to connect you just need to connect a doorbell switch or push button okay and connection of doorbell switch or push button you need to connect a parallel connection okay you can control load from 30 second to 20 minute by this staircase timer hope you clear the concept about this staircase timer switch if you like this video please press like button if you have any query please ask in comments box for today's enough we'll meet next video thanks for watching